Hello, Lions. This is your Reedy Google Academy Hangouts Edition. Welcome to the screencast. Uh, this uh, how-to video is presented on behalf of myself and Katrina, who work together to create this Google Academy on Hangouts. So what is Google Hangouts? Google Hangouts is a text messaging, is a platform that you can text message, do audio calls and video calls from using your FISD account. This uh, particular app is really useful when you are um, trying to communicate with people on campus. It's one way to really cut down on the number of emails that you're sending because um, you can communicate with people really, uh, really fast and really quickly with this app. So there's two ways to use this. You can either go to hangoutsgoogle.com and open it up in a tab like this. Or you can get the extension and have it uh, pop up over here. Katrina prefers the extension and I prefer to have it in a tab. So I keep this tab up all day and you can change out who, who you have messages with over here. So for instance, if I wanted to, uh, you know, take that one out and add, you know, um, this one right here, I can do it that way. So you can click on these over here and bring them out. When, and if uh, somebody messages you, it'll get darker right here. And then you'll know that you have a message from that person and you can open it up over here if you want to um, respond in that moment. Okay. So did you know you can keep Google Hangouts open on your Chrome, bros Chrome browser all day uh, on your PC in your classroom or at your cube and um, you may just have to refresh it from time to time but then you can communicate with people on your team or in your department or anyone really on campus or district-wide um, you can also communicate with people outside the district as well uh, there is an app so you can get the app for your phone and this is what it looks like on your phone and then whether you're you know in the classroom or you're in the hall or wherever you are you can pull up the app and respond to people's messages really quickly hangouts is not blocked on the Wi-Fi either so if you're using your phone on the Wi-Fi you can um, message and make calls on the FISD Wi-Fi um, you can also make quick audio and video calls on Hangouts. So if you're uh, needing to call a teammate or something and you, and you want to do it through Hangouts, you can do it on your phone that way. Um, and so that is something that's really easy. And so when you're in the app, you can just make quick calls. You can also share images on your Hangouts. So on your Dell keyboard, all you have to do is hit print screen and then control V and paste that uh, image into your Hangout. So these are pasted images into your Hangout. Um, and that way, if you're working with a, or you can use the snipping tool, which is handy, snag the picture, hit the copy button, control V and text message. Um, so that way, if you're working with a teammate and you're like, hey, what do you think about this? And they're not in the same document as you or something, you can do a quick print screen, pop it into Hangouts and they can look at it like that. Um, also, whenever you're in Hangouts and you have an image, you can double click the image or you can click on it, I mean, and it will open up really big. So if you're like, oh my gosh, I can't see that, you can open it up really big, just like that, okay? Um, so in our training, there are three challenges. So if you want to do those now, if you want to pause the video and do the challenges, you can. So challenge number one, you're going to log into your FISD Google account. You're going to navigate to hangouts.google.com, and you're going to create a new Hangout conversation. Uh, Hangout conversations, for me, I have Hangout Conversations. These are a couple of librarians. These are all the FISD high school librarians. And then Katrina and I have one. Kelly Monroe and I have one. Um, so these are people that you want to communicate with on a regular basis. So you want to create those, whoops, so you want to create those groups um, in your, in your um, Hangouts and invite all the people that you would need to communicate with. And if there's one or two people, you can have you can have big group ones and then pull out separate ones or even individual ones. That's totally, totally something you can do. Um, if you don't know what people you should put in it, you can always just do one with me and Katrina and we'll be happy to try it out with you. Uh, challenge number two, you're gonna send a text message to your team, your department, or your buddies uh, and take a screenshot of something you want the Hangout group to see and then copy and paste that image into your Hangout. For challenge number three, uh, you'll have to do this from either your phone or a Chromebook, but you can download the Hangouts app uh, if you want to do it on your phone, or you can do it on a Chromebook because you need a webcam. But you can do a video call or an audio call uh, from either the app or your Chromebook. The, invi the Hangouts invitation has to be accepted for the other person to um, get your call.
So that's really the the down and dirty of uh, Google Hangouts. And we wanted to have this video available to you so you can go back and review it at any time. When you're in Hangouts, if you wanted to call someone, all you have to do is click the video call button here. And if you're on your phone, you'll have the option of either um, a, a video or audio. So when you're on your when you're on it, you can turn off your video and then it's just an audio call. All right, we're going to hang that up now. Um, and then you'll notice that in my Hangouts, so when I'm in an audio call, I have the choice to mute my mic or mute my camera. So this is obviously with the camera on. And you'll notice in your Hangouts call, it'll show up that you were in a video, that you were in a call or you were in a video call. And so you'll be able to have that. And it's great because you'll have lots of history here that you can scroll back and see, wait, what did they say about that? So it's just a really, really nice um, productivity app. All right. If you guys have any questions about this, feel free to reach out to me or Katrina. We would love to help you. Good luck with Google Hangouts.